Hello everyone, it's Myla. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be finally going over my vintage cheek scents. Um, I did a pre-order, a couple RTSs, and a D-stash or two, but um, I want to go over this because I love vintage cheek and um, I want to start to store this uh, wax properly. So um, this is in no particular order, but let's get started and I hope everyone's doing well. So the first one I have here is the Warrens. And this is a classic scent. And the Warrens is um, glazed cinnamon donuts, a cup of mulled cider topped with gooey marshmallows, caramel drizzle, and sweet cinnamon. And this is on cold, you get that cider note, but when this is melting, like all those other good notes come out, like the cinnamon donuts, the sweet cinnamon, the marshmallows. So a classic scent, the Warrens. Okay, just a heads up, I think this video is going to be long. But I just want to give you a heads up on that. So, okay. I have, um, yeah, let's go over. Actually, we'll go over this loaf. Okay. I have 12 Jackies and I have, this is layers of vanilla cakes, papaya, and mango filling topped with marshmallows, marshmallow whip, and fresh sliced strawberries. And I wanted to try this one out because a lot of people talk about this bun, the Jackie's. So I was like, let's give it a try. So it's fruity. This is really good. You definitely get like that papaya. Is there a pineapple in here? No, mango. Okay. Papaya. I'm getting, it's like a tropical fruit mixed with like cake. 12 Jackie's. Wow, this is strong. And this was just born in um, October. So looking forward to trying this one out. 12 Jackies. This one was from her um, Barbie collection. And I ended up picking up two of these because I saw the notes on this. And it's uh, the name of the blend is called um, Too Much too much pink never <laughs> and it's boom boom pink sugar and cotton candy and it's that I think she calls this Chantilly or, a Chant or something glass this is so beautiful like you get that pink sugar note and I'm sorry I'm listening to my son and my husband upstairs <laughs> So you get the pink sugar note mixed with boom boom and that cotton candy like it's such a beautiful blend like i love boom boom and um the boom boom blend with like strawberries or pink sugar so when i saw this i was like i had to grab it it's really good so i have two bags of this too much pink never and i'm trying to put it back into place properly <laughs> here it is really pretty um i will go let me go into this one here so i'm sorry i have like i ordered a bunch of like rts's and it's kind of all like thrown on my desk right now so and they're like there's some from like the barbie collection the um, Beanie Baby collection, but here's one. Uh, this is Martha Stewart's Cinnamon Glaze Baklava. And it's a pretty rose. And this is Zucchini Bread, Vanilla Butterfudge, Cupcakes at Tiffany's, and Cinnamon Glazed Baklava. This is so good. It's like zucchini with like a hint of cinnamon sugar oh this is so good wow i think like anything martha stewart is 
That blend is so good. This is um, Martha Stewart's cinnamon uh, glazed baklava. I feel like I'm getting tongue tied here. <laughs> um, so I picked up two of the Martha's popcorn on the cob. And when I originally, I, will, I was going to pick up four. So I picked up two at first and then I wanted to change it to four. And then I was like, don't, because it's probably going to sell out and you're going to lose it. So I picked up two of these. And um, this is uh, kettle corn, vanilla butter fudge, zucchini bread, and rich vanilla cupcakes. Another pretty rose. Oh, this is so good because you're getting that kettle corn. It's kind of similar to Martha and Snoop, but you get that kettle corn note. Oh, this is good. I've been wanting to try this, but at least I got two, right? Two's better than nothing. So this is really good. Nice um, zucchini blend. Martha's popcorn on the cob. Okay, I picked up caramel apple Jackie O. And I'm actually melting through one of these right now. And this is beautiful. This is um, rich vanilla bean cake topped with red apples, whipped marshmallows, and a sweet caramel drizzle. And you get, um, like I'm not really, like I, I, I do like apple scents, but this with mixed with the caramel apple, the caramel mixed with the apple, this is really nice on warm. So I figured I would grab a backup of this because this is like a nice fall, um, wintertime scent. So caramel apple Jackie O beautiful and the leaves I didn't show the leaves there two-toned and you get two in there excuse me okay um, I picked up two snookies I'll just go over one and snooky is boardwalk marshmallow cloud type and strawberry pound cake and I love boardwalk marshmallow cloud and it's the ghost face, and here's the label. This is pretty. It, it leans a little to my nose, a little body care, but that's all right. Mixed with strawberries. Really, really pretty. You get that strawberry and that marsh boardwalk marshmallow cloud. Very, very nice. Snooky. I'm looking at the name because I'm thinking of um, Jersey Shore. So it's like kind of making me giggle. <laughs> that was Snooky. Um, all right, let's get into this one here. This is Grandma's Pink Pearls. And... This is lavender vanilla marshmallows dusted with pink sugar and peppermint. And when I saw this, I was like, that's like my perfect nighttime blend. So I wanted to try this. This is so good because you get the lavender, the pink sugar, the peppermint. Oh, this is so good. This is like perfect nighttime melt for me. Oh, I love it. It's beautiful. A beautiful lavender blend. Love it. Grandma's Pink Pearls. It's like a little mix of everything, right? <laughs> okay, I have um, two White Christmas and I'm going to put this aside here. And White Christmas is Buttermint Vanilla Bean Noel. Buttermint Vanilla Bean Noel. I said it right. I'm like, this is called White Christmas. And I actually picked up a Christmas tree. It's a huge Christmas tree in the D-stash, and I'll go over that. 
And this is so good because I love her butter mints mixed with the vanilla bean Noel. This is so beautiful. Ooh, I love this. This is such a good blend. White Christmas. Fabulous. Okay. I'm like running out of room. And this one I picked up. This is What Was I Made For? And it's vanilla lace, boardwalk marshmallow clouds, and fresh strawberries. I think Snooky is strawberry pound cake. Okay. It's another pretty rose. It's got the pink on the back. Oh, that's pretty. This is, um, you get the strawberries with the vanilla lace and then the boardwalk marshmallow clouds. This leans a little body care too. To me, it does. But I don't mind that and I like it. And this is what was I made for? all right i'm gonna get into the um beanie baby she had like the beanie baby um collection and i actually ordered a because she had 30 percent off on i think around halloween and um i ordered the beanie baby um sampler collection the um it was like a little sampler but i didn't get it in one of my orders and i emailed kirby and she is going to send that to me but um i did pick up uh four blends so the first one i have here is alley the alligator and it's pink chiffon soft amber raw coconut tonka bean and turquoise it's one of her um cute unicorns <laughs> Ooh, I saw pink chiffon, so I was like, I'm going to grab it. So I saw the pink chiffon and the coconut. So you are getting pink chiffon, coconut, and then the amber and the tonka are mixed in there. But it has a freshness. Maybe it's from the turquoise. This is pretty. Definitely leans body care, but I'm okay with that. Um, I have a lot of her bakeries, so I wanted to try some of her blends that weren't bakery so this is Allie the alligator I have princess bear and that's vanilla lace soft amber raw coconut and tonka bean so this one you get more of the vanilla lace this is more of like a vanilla blend it's pretty on cold I wonder how this will come out on warm because you've got the amber, the coconut, and the tonka bean. Very similar to Allie's, the alligator, Allie the alligator, but this one has pink chiffon and turquoise in it. So, pretty, pretty vanilla scent. And that's Princess Bear. Okay. I have Gobbles the turkey. And it's butterscotch marshmallow, sweet potato, brown sugar, and gooey marshmallows. Like gobbles the turkey. <laughs> Look how pretty the unicorn is. This is different. It, it does smell like sweet potato. I don't have too many like sweet potato blends. I think I have one with Rose Girls. So I wanted to try this one out. So it smells like sweet potato with um, like brown sugar. That's what it reminds me of, like sweet potato casserole, if you're familiar with that. I love that around Thanksgiving. That's what, it, that's what it's giving me right now on cold. I'd like to see how this would come out on warm. And that's Gobbles the turkey. <laughs> how pretty the glitter is. Okay. I have Mystic, and it's Whimsical Vanilla Figs. 
It's a pretty pink unicorn with chunky glitter in there, huh? Oh, it has unicorn glitter in there. I don't know if you can see that. <laughs> this is body care leaning. Um, I'm not really getting much, like, it's kind of like sparkly. Whimsical vanilla figs. Hmm. Pretty though. Very, very pretty. This would be like nice for a, um, like, well, for me, I was thinking like my bathroom or my kitchen, but usually in my kitchen, I do lemon. So, but anyway, mystic, that's mystic. <laughs> All right. I have <laughs> beach bombshell and it's bright citrus coconut lotion and sea salt and it's these pretty um flowers and i just read it sorry long day at work long week at work wow this is fresh very very fresh this would be like nice for a bathroom or wherever you want to put it bedroom this would be a nice summer scent. It reminds me of like the beach because it's like coconut, lotion, sea salt. Mm, this is really pretty. And I wanted to try this because I think I've already, already said this, but um, I do have so much of her bakery and it's nice to try other um, blends that aren't bakery. So that's Beach Bombshell. Okay, and um, I wanted to share my Jacko Lantern Loaf that I picked up um, last month, and this is Lucy, Lucy and Ethel, and it's pistachio coconut um, pudding a cake topped with marshmallows. Um, I did pick up a souffle in a, in a pre-order but I love this blend so much and um I had to get this because but it broke so I put it in this bag so it kind of stays together I can like smell it through here <laughs> like I don't want to open it but this is it right here it's really really look how big it is it weighs a lot too oh I love this blend this is one of my favorite blends so I wanted to share that. Unfortunately, it broke, broke when it came in the mail, but that's all right. We all cut it up in the end. So, all right, I will be right back and um, go over some of my other orders. Hi, welcome back. All right, so I'm going to get into the D-Stash that I purchased. <laughs> I think I picked this up in... October. October I picked this up, but um, this is a great box, so I was like, let's go over this. So this one is um, Magnolia Swizzle Sticks, and it's buttery vanilla, fresh dough, uh, fresh rolled dough, gooey batter, and a hint of sugar almonds and peppermint, like you just walked into a bakery, and it's a cute little um, gingerbread man. This is, oh my goodness, Magnolia Swizzle Sticks. Wow. So it's like peppermint or buttermint mixed with um, that Magnolia Bakery. So good. So I picked this one up. And I saw that um, the person was selling. Uh, she had Rise Up, and I've been looking for rise up and she had three of these um hearts so i was like all right i'll take them and this is cinnamon uh glazed donuts chestnuts brown sugar and zucchini bread so this is so good like i try i think i got wax on my lip i feel like i do <laughs> that or glitter wax glitter i can feel it okay is it off? Okay. Awkward. Anyway. Oh, this smells so good. 
Look how beautiful that heart is. So, so good. Um, I know she had this on the, on her website recently and it like sold out so quickly. So I was glad to pick up three of these hearts and these are from 2021 and, um, these are like ready to go. So I'm looking forward to melting these. That is rise up. Did I show that there. So I ended up picking up three of those. I think the other one's in there somewhere. Okay. I forgot to go over my beanie baby. So I got this little beanie baby um, in my order from the um, beanie baby, beanie baby um, collection that she had. So, and this is Mel, teeny beanie babies. And this is Mel and it's a little um, like koala bear. So I thought that was really, really cute to add that in there, right? So thank you, Kirby, for the beanie baby. I'm very appreciative of it. Okay. All right. Let's, uh, what is this? This is calming circle and it's sweet lavender, vanilla ice cream drizzled with coconut cream. This is a beautiful lavender. I didn't even show this. I'm like all over the place. Sorry. <laughs> this is like a nice sweet lavender because you get that it's vanilla ice cream drizzled with coconut cream i feel like lavender and, and coconut go so well together and it's like these cute shapes like there's like a little um ghost in there like there's one of the ghosts <laughs> oh it smells so good and i love lavender little um pumpkin <laughs> like what's in here Okay, and that is Calming Circle. Um, I picked up two of these, and she was selling two of these at the time. So this is What's Your, scare, what's your Favorite Scary Movie? And it's candy corn, cotton candy, sugar cookies, and buttercream frosting. I feel like buttercream frosting lately just gives, like, I don't know, like a, like a bakery blend. It just gives it something extra. Like I, it's really, I've been really noticing it in wax lately. So, and you get two, uh, two of these ghosts. It's sweet. I'm getting the buttercream frosting and I love that. It's with like sugar cookies and candy corn. It's like a sweet, like sugar cookie. Oh, that smells so good. This would be great for blending or on its own. So I ended up with two of those. Um, did I go rise up? I don't remember if I went over um, the notes on this, but this is so good with the chestnut, um, chestnuts, cinnamon glazed donuts, chestnuts, brown sugar, and zucchini bread. It's like a sweet zucchini bread. But it's, it's different because you've got chestnuts, cinnamon glazed donuts. Oh, this is so good. Sorry, I had to smell it again. And I don't know if I described the scent that well. <laughs> so, um, moving on. Okay, I have Defying Gravity, and this is Key Lime Cupcake with Cotton Candy Frosting. And this... Oh, this is good. This is uh, key lime with cotton candy. It's like a sweet key lime. Really nice, not too taut. Pretty. Really, really nice. Okay. And this seller was like buying, like, she had like doubles. So I ended up with two of those. So I said, why not? Okay. I have two um, Wayne's World, and Wayne's World is blackberry, uh, strawberry, sugar, rope, and taffy. And I love blackberry and strawberry. It's like, you definitely get the blackberry and the hint of that strawberry. Wow. 
I don't know what sugar rope taffy is, but maybe it's just like a, a sweet taffy. Really nice, fruity. Looking forward to trying these. And that is Wayne's World. Oh my gosh, my nose is itchy, excuse me. Okay. I have, here's Johnny, and it's um, Harvest Chestnuts and Brown Sugar. I don't know if you can see that. There it is. This is from 2021, but I know I've mentioned that um, her wax does so well with time. This is so good. So Harvest Chestnuts. So you do get that chestnut smell, scent, and that brown sugar. This is so good. I've never tried this one, and I'm looking forward to trying it. That's Here's Johnny. Sweet. Very good. Okay. I ended up with this. It's Axman, Axman of New Orleans. New Orleans. Um, sweet pumpkin milkshake topped with fresh whipped cream. Here's the loaf. Oh my goodness. This is like a creamy milk uh, pumpkin. What else is in this? Sweet pumpkin milkshake topped with fresh whipped cream. Yeah, it's not like heavy pumpkin. It's it's like the it's like a not a light pumpkin, but it's like a creamy pumpkin on cold. That's what I'm getting, but I'm looking forward to trying this one. And I think I have like pumpkin, sweet pumpkin Jackie O um, for a pumpkin blend of hers. So here's another one. Axemen of New Orleans. Okay, I have the Parent Trap, and this is vanilla sugar waffle cone with two scoops of vanilla ice cream, and I really like her. Um, did I say vanilla ice cream? Vanilla sugar waffle cone with two scoops of lavender ice cream. Oh my goodness, I'm like fried. <laughs> this is beautiful. It's a sweet lavender. And you get like that vanilla note and that um, waffle cone. Really, really nice. Um, this is new to me. Well, all, the, all of these are new to me, but <laughs> she has so many scents. But I, I do enjoy her lavender. And this is the parent trap. And that's, that's from the share, actually. June of the share. Okay, this one is Go Your Own Way, Pineapple Upside Down Cake, Cherry and Yellow Cake. And what caught my eye with this was the um, Pineapple Upside Down Cake, Cherry, cherry and Yellow Cake. I, th I, th I thought Coca-Cola was in there for a second. I really need glasses. I thought it was um, Cherry Coke. Forget it. Beautiful, though. So you do get the pineapple, um, the cherry, and it's a nice mix. Mixed with the yellow cake. So pineapple upside down cake, cherry, and yellow cake. Yeah, it's blended beautifully. This is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, that is go your own way. All right, I'm running out of room. Okay, I ended up picking up a Blossom Bar too, and this is Aunt Nellie's um, Easter celebration, and this is Peeps Rich Vanilla Cupcakes and Zucchini Bread. And this is one of our Blossom Bars. And this is from March of this year. And her zucchini bread is so good. And it's mixed with Peeps, rich vanilla cupcakes. It's like a, you get the cupcakes mixed with the zucchini. And then um, it's just sweet. Not super sweet though. Oh, I love this. 
I love it. This is Aunt Noe's Easter celebration. Fabulous. And I picked up a one of these trees. <laughs> And she was selling um, buttermint vanilla bean Noel, which is white Christmas. And this is like compared to my head. <laughs> and I have a big head too. So. Um, but this is, I, I have it. I picked it up in the um, roses. And um, I'm looking forward to eventually getting into this. So I love her buttermint so much that... I didn't mind picking it up in a Christmas tree. So, okay, that is my D stash. And I will get into my pre order next. So, I'll be right back. Okay, hi, welcome back. All right, so this is my pre order that I did in July. And I actually found two loaves in there from another D stash, but it's all vintage cheek. So, let's just go over it. But this is part of my pre order. So, I did Baby Leroy. And this is uh, Lavender, Vanilla, and Baby Magic. And I wanted to try this. I've been on a, not on a kick, but um, like I bought a swanky loaf that kind of similar to this. Like it's that, um, it smells like a baby. Kind of has like a baby powder smell, but that lavender mixed with it, mixed in with it. It's so pretty. So... Um, I wanted to try this. I didn't get a blossom bar in it, so I was like, the souffle would be good. So um, I picked up We'll Always Have Paris, and this is an exclusive sweet fruity blend. I don't know what's in here, but I'm getting... It's fruity. There's watermelon in here. Like, I'm getting... Hints of watermelon, probably strawberry, but it's very pretty. It's definitely fruity. <laughs> very nice. We'll always have Paris. Uh, zip up, snap in. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, Lucy and Apple. And I have a souffle in it too. And that is pistachio coconut coconut pudding cake topped with marshmallows. Oh my gosh. This is so good. If you like pistachio, you would love this blend. Lucy and Ethel. So good. So that was part of my pre-order that I did. Um, let's get into these loaves here. Um, and these were like done over from, so this pre-order was what, in July? So July, August, September, October. So the last few months. All right. So I picked up, this is a D stash, but, um, this is fresh pick, uh, Miss, Dear Mr. Gabble, and it's fresh picked strawberries, butter cookies, and zucchini bread. So I was like, I saw this and I'm like, sold. This is so good. Fresh picked strawberries, butter cookies, and zucchini bread. Beautiful, beautiful strawberry zucchini blend. Um, I picked up, whoop, there it is, and it's blueberry meringue tort. And I actually have her blueberry meringue tort with cheesecake, but um, and what made me pick this one up was I had a I had a blend. I think it was called like Man in the Moon, and it was blueberry meringue tort with zucchini bread. So when I saw this on that D stash site on Facebook, um, I was like, I gotta grab this so I can mix it with zucchini bread. So um, blueberry meringue tort. And it's blueberry mixed with like lemon. This is so good. So, and that's whoop. There it is. Okay. 
Oh yeah, I did pick this one up. This is the Griswolds and um, this is such a beautiful, beautiful um, blend. It's rich buttery cookies topped with cinnamon buttercream frosting on warm. This is so, so good. Ugh. I feel like on cold, it's good on cold, but on warm, it's just like that cinnamon buttercream comes through, or that buttercream frosting mixed with the, the cinnamon and the buttery cookies. It's, it's like, it smells like you're cooking like cinnamon cookies or some type of cookies in the oven. That's, that's what I get from it. And this is the Griswolds and I wanted to get it in a loaf. So I picked that one up. Okay, that's what I have for loaves. Now let's get into the Blossom Bars. I have a few here. Okay, so I have Christmas Time is Here, and it's sugar cookies, Christmas trees, and a hint of peppermint. Oh. This is so good. Because you get, it's like a hint of Christmas tree with sugar cookies and you get that peppermint like what a perfect like holiday or christmas blend peppermint christmas trees and sugar cookies oh, this is so good so good and this is christmas time is here this is so beautiful so i have that blossom bar um i have chestnuts and brown sugar cupcakes and it's yummy rich vanilla cupcakes smeared with brown sugar and chestnut frosting and i was thinking holidays when i was purchasing these and like i don't have um like too many uh like chestnuts oh this is different but it's sweet yummy Rich vanilla cupcake smeared with brown sugar and chestnut frosting. Oh, you can smell that mixed with that brown sugar. Like I know I had a souffle that I just went over that was very similar to that. But this is good. I think the difference in this one is it has sugar cookies and um, yummy rich vanilla cupcakes smeared. Oh no, cupcakes, excuse me. Smeared with brown sugar and chestnut frosting. Yummy. Sweet. You can smell it. I love it. You can smell it. I wish you could smell it. <laughs> okay. I have um, Christmas tree cakes. Um, Christmas tree cakes, ice cream, zucchini. And I had to pick this one up. So I have her Christmas tree cakes, um, just the vanilla one and um, the strawberry one I have too. So now I have the, of course I picked up the zucchini, right? so good so it's that vanilla ice cream yellow cake vanilla buttercream zucchini bread and a touch of green sprinkles on cold it's like a sweet zucchini is there any i don't know if there's any brown sugar in it or not so so good and this is christmas tree cakes ice cream zucchini okay I picked up Stand By Me, and this is Amish Friendship Bread topped with black uh, blueberry jam. And I have a souffle of this upstairs right now that I'm melting. This is good. It's not zucchini bread. I feel like, I feel like Amish bread. Is this Amish? Yeah, Amish Friendship Bread. It's like a bready note with um, blueberry. This is good but it's not zucchini. I'm starting to like Amish uh, bread or Amish friendship bread. Nice bready note with blueberry. Very, very nice. Beautiful. Okay. I picked up Goodbye Aunt Nellie and it's peanut butter cream, cheese frosting, rich vanilla cupcakes, and zucchini bread. So I saw peanut butter because I wanted like a 
I think I might have mentioned in that, um, one of my videos that I don't have a lot of peanut butter, so I wanted to grab this, and I saw that there was zucchini in it, so I was like, and it's one of Aunt Nellie's blends, so. Yes. Yep. It's a nice peanut butter. It's not heavy on the peanut butter. It's like a nice, it's like a hint of peanut butter mixed with the zucchini but the zucchini is not too strong in this either this is blended beautifully wow this is goodbye aunt nelly peanut butter cream cheese frosting rich vanilla cupcakes and zucchini bread beautiful okay i have a few awesome bars left <laughs> i picked up billy Billy's sugared strawberries and it's gooey strawberries, sugared strawberries, rich vanilla cakes, yellow cakes, and rich sugar cookies. And I love anything Billy Boss Nova. <laughs> the blend on its own. And I have Billy's strawberry pound cake, so I wanted to try the sugared strawberries. This is good. This is really good. This is fresh picked. It's sugared strawberries. So sugared strawberries. It's a nice creamy strawberry bakery blend. Oh, this is good. Mixed with the Billies. Yeah, Boss Nova. Really, really good. Okay. All right. <laughs> Let's get into this one here. Okay. Oh, I wanted to show like this container I threw it in. I picked this container up because it stacks like perfectly with ooh, blossom bars so um i picked this up at like five i don't know if you can see that uh dollar general Donald, dollar general had them on sale and i was like well maybe i can stack my um blossom bars in them so i am very nice all right I picked up, uh, they don't know what we know, and they know we know. They don't know that we know, they know we know. Fresh picked strawberries and blackberry jam butter cookies. That is a beautiful blend, so I, I picked up a blossom bar in it. Oh my goodness. So, blackberry jam butter cookies mixed with strawberry or even strawberry pound cake. Oh, this is so good on cold. Again, I'm going to let these cure um, probably until next year <laughs> before I start even getting into them. Um, I picked up It Was All a Dream, and it's uh, lavender sugar cookies topped with coconut cream, frosting, and fresh picked strawberries. I've had this, and I like this. This is a beautiful blend. So it's like a sweet lavender because you get the sugar cookies and the coconut. Oh gosh, lavender and coconut, that goes well. And then you have fresh picked strawberries. This is so pretty, really, really pretty. And again, lavender for nighttime melting. And that was, it was all a dream. <laughs> I have um, the Crescent uh, the Crescent Hotel Cafe, which is Reg Reggio and Snickers coffee cafe cafe mocha marshmallow. I don't know. I don't know the name of this. Is this the Crescent? Maybe it's the Crescent Hotel Cafe Reggio. It's okay, I think it's a coffee blend. See it there. I feel like there's another sticker over it. It was the Crescent Hotel, because I see another sticker over it. The Crescent Hotel, which is, I think it's Snickers Coffee, um, Cafe Mocha and Marshmallows. That's what I think it is. Or Salted Caramel on there, I don't know. And I don't really have like any of Kirby's coffee blend so i wanted to try this because it had snickers um, mocha marshmallow coffee this is really this is like a sweet coffee 
It kind of reminds me of coffee ice cream. But this is good. So I wanted to try her coffee blends because I don't have any. <laughs> okay, I picked up Noel. Oh, my Blossom Bar stock is too high over here. And there it is. And it's um, pumpkin eggnog and cupcakes. And I love pumpkin and eggnog. Oh, this is so good. It's like a creamy pumpkin with, um, whew, this is so good. Creamy pumpkin with eggnog and cupcakes. Yeah. Like, I definitely love that. I picked up Uptown Girls, and now I'm going to finally melt the don't. I have, like, a couple donuts of, um, this blend. This is such a good blend. This is um, yellow cake and blackberry jam butter cookies. So good. It's like I didn't even want to melt those last two like um, donut shapes that I had because I was like, oh, I'm never going to get it. Well, I have a Boston bar now. This is so good. It's like a creamy um, blackberry butter jam cookie. And it's mixed with that yellow cake, so happy to have that. Um, I have Nellie Rose, Nellie Rose's uh, co uh, cotton candy, and it's strawberry old-fashioned donut dipped in a decadent vanilla glaze and a side of cotton candy. And it's like a pretty pink blossom bar, so okay. Oh my gosh, this is so good. So it's strawberry, cotton candy. Is there donuts in this? Yes. Dip, strawberry old-fashioned donut dipped in a decadent vanilla glaze and a side of cotton candy. I love cotton candy mixed in with um, wax or cotton candy frosting. Just makes it like sweeter and creamier. So beautiful, beautiful strawberry blend with cotton candy. Love it. Um, this is Aunt Nellie's uh, holiday treat and it's layers of vanilla bean cake, bear claws, zucchini bread, and topped with whipped marshmallows. And it's this one right here. Like a cream color. Oh gosh, layers of vanilla bean cake, bear claws, zucchini bread topped with whipped marshmallows. I love her zucchini bread, as you can see. It's like a, you're getting that, um, that bear claws. It's like a, not cinnamony, but it kind of has like a hint of cinnamon to it. And, um, the zucchini bread. Oh, Aunt Nellie's holiday treat, layers of vanilla bean cake. Bear claws, zucchini bread topped with whipped marshmallows. Yes. Fabulous. Okay. I have two um, blossom bars left, and I'll go over the samples. I know this is long. Apricot Nelly Rose. It's strawberry old-fashioned donut um, dipped in a decadent apricot vanilla glaze. Really pretty. Nice apricot color. Okay. And this is, you get that, you do get that apricot, but this is so pretty. I feel like apricot, like a lot of people don't talk about apricot. I think it's so underrated. So you do get like that hint of strawberry. Oh, this is so nice. It's a strawberry old fashioned dip donut with an apricot glaze, vanilla glaze. Yes. And that is Apricot Nelly Rose. Yes. Really good. And the last Blossom Bar I have here is Pretty Woman. And I seen this sitting on the site. And I saw that it's um, a Cyberries uh, satin. And it says Herbal Essence type. And here's the blend here. And I was like, I've always liked the smell of Herbal Essence. Like, that shampoo. So I was like, why don't I get this? 
it smells just like it. If you're familiar with Herbal Essence Shampoo, I used to love to wear that or, or use it like, like when I was in high school because I loved the way like it used to make my hair smell. So it's bringing me back to like high school years. <laughs> so I'm like, why don't I get this? Because I obviously I, I do a lot of bakery um, with Vintage Chic, but I wanted to try this. And when I picked up some of these Blossom Bars, she was having a sale. So, okay. So that was my um, Blossom Bar pre-order. Some of them might have been ready to ship. Um, but anyway, let's get into some of these samples. So I have You'll Never Walk Alone, cup, uh, which is cup, cupcakes, cookies, cinnamon, buttercream frosting. Cupcakes, cookies, yes. Kind of reminds me of the Warrens a little bit. Cupcakes, cookies, cinnamon, buttercream frosting. Again, I love that buttercream frosting. Really good. Um, Noel, which I have a Blossom Bar in. I think I have two of those, actually. Yeah, I have another one down there. Okay. Sorry, I didn't show it. But I already went over the blend. Um, this is Ken's Mojo Dojo Casa House. This is part of the Barbie collection that she had. And that is Boozy, Boozy Bites. This is nice. I don't know what it is. It leans like body care-ish, but it's pretty really nice i like it i don't know what the notes are but it does lean body care body care vibes but i i do like it okay i have um burt and ernie which is satsuma blueberry uh lemon lime fizz topped with orange whip eek don't drop it i gotta cut these nails down oh my gosh her satsuma i really really like and i've been really liking it lately mixed with blueberry lemon lime topped with orange oil this is going to be strong this is strong already her satsuma and as is strong anyway i think it's a strong note as is but mixed with lemon lime fizz and orange whip and blueberry yeah looking forward to trying that one this is nuts nuts the squirrel almond rum cake with pistachio pudding filling. Pudding filling. <laughs> oh gosh. You need pistachio. You like the almond leans pistachio, so and then you have pistachio in there. It's like a nice pistachio blend. Almond run cake, pistachio pudding filling. Yes. That is nuts the squirrel. <laughs> Okay, I have Holiday Barbie. It's sugared spruce, cranberry orange, spice, clove, nutmeg, and juniper. Wow, that's a nice holiday blend. You do get that, like, nutmeg and clove mixed in with the, like, um, cranberry and orange. This is really nice. This is, like, a nice... It reminds me of Christmas, but it's really, really pretty. This is Holiday Barbie. Wow. Really nice. And the last one I have here is Patty the pl uh, Platypus. <laughs> and that is candied orange covered cotton candy and grapes. And I like this because you're getting um, orange and grape. And I have a new love for grape and wax. And I'm getting wax all over me. Okay. And I do actually have a Beanie Baby sample coming in. But um, I think this is enough wax here. So that is my last few Vintage Cheek scents. Um, Pre-order, a few RTSs, and... Um, D stash. So 
Let me know in the comments, guys, if you have melted any of these or if you purchased any of these. I would love to hear your thoughts. And th this is a long video, so thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you all have a wonderful day and night, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Take care. Thank you.